The federal government recently took the monopoly away from the Canadian Wheat Board. There's no just cause, there's no reason to go back on this, none whatsoever. Many Manitoba farmers are really happy that they no longer have to sell their wheat to the Canadian Wheat Board. Now you sell it to whoever wants to buy it, whether that be uh, a big uh, grain company like Patterson or Viterra or uh, to, a, to a mill, whether that be here in Canada. The Friends of the Canadian Wheat Board have filed a lawsuit to get its status back as they say it protects farmers from being taken advantage of by multinational companies and the railways. Domain farmer Graham Maness reacts to that. I haven't heard one farmer in this area tell me that uh, they were very upset or disappointed about how uh, how this has all come about. So I don't. I think they're uh, they're they're just wasting their time, probably their own money and taxpayers' money, fighting with the federal government about this. It's, uh, as far as I'm concerned, it's pointless. Bob Roll, a retired employee of the Canadian Wheat Board and a spokesman for the Friends of the Canadian Wheat Board, says it will take five years before everyone will see the true effects of the farmer's newfound freedom. Jim Bender, Winnipeg Sun.